it is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below oh my god i love it i love it so much all right capricorn what's the overall energy bottom of the deck page of wands in page of wands i'm so sorry page of wands communication coming in exciting good news communication uh, uh good news exciting communication coming in someone wants to talk someone wants to talk something uh someone wants some passionate communication that's going to come in that's the overall energy in the past we see that someone gave up on a connection or someone just put their guards down okay someone could have been very very defensive in the past but now they let their guards down in the past right now someone's being um a either someone's ignoring or avoiding someone or something or a situation why is because the high priestess in reverse someone's trusting finding it very hard to trust their intuition okay that's why they're probably avoiding or ignoring a situation all right i have a feeling here that there is someone here who's avoiding a you know um a relationship or avoiding to look at things because they're trusting their logic more than their intuition could be dealing with a cancer or a pisces okay someone's trusting their logic over intuition like no like you know what you know the high priestess in reverse is someone you know finds it very difficult to trust their intuition they they, they they're choosing to believe that what their gut and their logic is saying it's the same thing okay but that's not what it is okay and that's why they're ignoring a situation they're like literally sneaking away from a situation okay i get that feeling page of pentacles on me on your mind capricorn you want to start something brand new you want a whole new approach towards a situation okay i don't see this as a new person this is definitely someone from your past okay you want to restart communication you could have been uh, in a no communication mode right now with this person at a distance from this person whatever but i don't think you're communicating with this person you want to start something new something stable something solid okay page of pentacles is starting something uh, giving something a very different approach okay not doing the same thing again yep Sorry, Capricorn. So I see the reason for the reading is because you could be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone's emotionally shut off. Someone's being very emotionally distant, emotionally very, very cold and detached. This could be someone who's very, very hurt in the past. All right, and that's why probably this is the the reason someone's shut off. Like I said, there could be no communication between you both. Yeah, but you have a relationship coming in. <clears throat> Capricorn you have a relationship coming in you have the two of cups here that's a soulmate connection that's two people being together that's a reunion if you guys are in separation but yeah i think you're going to be successful in your new whole new approach if this is not you capricorn this is someone who's coming in towards you with the relationship Clarify the page of wands here. Why is the page of wands here as the overall energy for Capricorn? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Look, look how much they want to talk. I saw, I just saw the Knight of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. Clarify the page of wands here. What did I just say? Look, someone wants to communicate after after going through an ending. Sorry, guys. So someone wants to communicate after an ending. Okay, someone feels betrayed, or there was just. and overkill okay this is an ending of a painful cycle like i said right this definitely looks like a reconciliation to me you guys could have gone through an ending it could have been very painful someone feels betrayed cheated but there was a cycle that completed okay between you guys could have been very hurtful clap for the ten of swords what is this ten of swords clap for the ten of swords yeah definitely a soulmate connection and now someone's coming back to you from the past we have the six of cups more water energy pisces cancer scorpio there could be a significant difference between you both an age difference religion could be living at a distance from you but someone from your past is coming back after you had a very painful ending with them okay they love you this is a soulmate connection it's a soulmate tie just cannot break it all right clarify the seven of wands in reverse what is the seven of wands in reverse in the past clarify the seven of wands in reverse 
someone gave up on a connection because you guys just couldn't come together okay three of pentacles in reverse is low collaboration no teamwork okay it was just probably i feel there was just one person who was doing all the work and they were not even feeling appreciated someone was like you know what i'm not putting in the effort you do everything okay and someone just got sick and tired and fed up okay and they gave up on a connection like if i'm doing everything then why are we in a relationship someone was not committed to this relationship in the past i have the three of pentacles in reverse yeah but things could have moved on very fast or probably someone wanted to move things very very quick okay like lightning bolt speed there could have been a lot of communication passionate communication back and forth but probably it's like if the communication is good but then there is no commitment to this okay if there is no value attached to this then what is the point clarify for the seven of swords why is the seven of swords here you could be living at a distance from this person i get it more okay there could be someone who would be wanting to travel towards you clarify the seven of swords okay the hierophant in reverse okay so someone's ignoring or avoiding someone because someone's not committed or someone's being extremely stubborn okay the hierophant in reverse you could be dealing with the taurus it can go two ways either someone's wanting to leave a a, a long term commitment or wanting to leave a marriage but right now they're avoiding doing that or someone's just avoiding a commitment okay someone's just avoiding someone who's absolutely non committed all right have the hierophant in reverse the hierophant in reverse is also someone who's got very non traditional ways all right so they've just got their own way they don't want to do it the way it's been happening all the time okay they don't want something traditional try from the hierophant in reverse they very very stubborn about their views and they like it's like no it's my way nothing doing try for the hierophant in reverse yeah and that's why someone someone released something they let this person go because they were non committal Okay, they were non-committal. Clear for the high priestess in reverse. Clear for the high priestess in reverse. Yeah, someone's trusting their logic over intuition, like I said, and that's why they're not ready to open up. Page of Cups in reverse. More water sign. Uh, this is someone who's not wanting to make any unrealistic moves. Okay, could be someone who thinks something could have been revealed, and now this person see, sees things for what it is. Okay, they see things for reality. Page of Cups is someone very dreamy, okay, but now they're not uh, in their dreamland or fantasy land anymore. They see things and they don't want to make any moves that is just, you know, more like a fantasy move rather than something more realistic. Clear for the Page of Cups in reverse. Could be dealing with a younger water sign who's very emotionally immature. Clear for the Page of Cups in reverse. Yeah, because someone was highly manipulative. Could be someone manipulative. The magician in reverse, Virgo, Gemini energy. Someone who's very self-serving. Okay, someone whose intentions are not the best, and uh, they will they will get whatever they want at the cost at the expense of someone else. Okay, the magician in reverse is someone who who feels very powerless about a situation. It could also be that there was some information that was revealed, and now this person sees things for what it is, and now they feel very powerless over a situation. Like I can't, just cannot do anything about it, because there was someone who was non-committal, and they let this person go. Okay, they could be holding on to this person for a very long time, and now not on, not only are they they letting them go, they're completely avoiding this situation. Okay, so I have the page of Pentacles. Go for the page of Pentacles. Yeah, someone wants to talk, but they're lacking confidence. The strength in reverse could be dealing with a Leo. The someone here who's not very confident about making this move, but they definitely want to start something stable, like have a sensible uh, communication. We have the justice in reverse because things are not going to be balanced, or someone needs to get out of something legal. The justice in reverse is ending a legal contract, ending a marriage, could be anything but to do with legal. Or this is just someone you know where karma is paying off. Like they just feel that things are completely unfair and unbalanced. Okay. Clear for the Queen of Cups in reverse. Clear for the Queen of Cups in reverse. Clear for the Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah. Yeah. Someone's emotionally cold, but they could be uh, the page of swords in reverse is again and immature. There's a lot of immaturity here, guys. A lot of immaturity here. Okay, now I see why all this is getting screwed up. 
Page of Swords in Reverse, Page of Cups in Reverse, Emotionally Immature, Immature in Communication, Page of Swords in Reverse. So someone's emotionally shut down, but at the same time, probably they're spying and stalking on you. They know everything, they know what's happening, they have the information, but they're just not opening their mouth. Could be someone very arrogant, at the same time, they could be someone who's waiting for you to communicate. But the point is, even if you communicate, are they ready to open up? Clarify for the Page of Swords in Reverse. That's just someone playing mind games. They're just playing mind games. They're emotionally manipulative. They're playing mind games. They're getting you to open your mouth or you're getting someone to open their mouth. Like, no, you talk first. Apply for the page of swords in reverse. Yeah, because someone wants a peaceful resolution. There's someone who wants to, you know, there's some, this is more like move into calmer waters, okay? They want to move into calmer waters. They're emotionally unavailable. They're shut down. They're stalking, they're spying, but they don't want to talk. But then they want to move towards you. The Six of Swords is a traveling car too, but we're in quarantine. There's not much we can do. Clap with the Six of Swords. Yeah. Five of Pentacles in reverse. Someone wants to return back after being left out in the cold. Someone feels abandoned. Someone feels left out. Someone's giving someone the cold shoulder, not not receive, not replying to their messages. But whoever is left out in the cold, they want to return back, Okay. They want to move into karma waters. They want to move with you. They want to move towards you. Clap for the two of cups. Clap for the two of cups. Yeah. Someone wants a relationship but because they're missing you. Clap for the four of cups. I don't see discontent or dissatisfaction. I feel they're missing you a lot. They could have had a lot of options. But they're just fearing rejection. Someone wants a relationship but someone's fearing rejection. They just don't know if you're going to accept their offer or not. Clap for the four of cups. Someone does realize that they love someone. Clap for the Four of Cups. Yeah, they're letting go anything that is toxic. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, okay? The devil in reverse is releasing anything, any unhealthy attachment, releasing fear. There's a lot of fear here around this relationship. Someone just doesn't know that now if I offer this relationship. So Capricorn, if you want to offer this relationship to someone, you're just not sure if they're going to accept it or not. There's someone here who has a lot of fear. They need to release the fear. The devil in reverse, okay? They're ready to let go anything that is unhealthy and toxic, okay? That's the devil in reverse. What is this devil in reverse? Yeah. Because someone's fed up. They feel you'll cut them out if you if, if they make you this offer, okay? The queen of swords is someone who just wants the truth, okay? Someone wants truthful communication they want to release anything that was toxic in this relationship anything that was negative but they're just fearing rejection if they come into you with this offer all right you both know you both love each other but one of them is very very afraid here okay however they're ready to release anything any bad habits or any negative patterns that were surrounding this and they're going to come and communicate with you the queen of swords is communication but it's like very, very candid, like to the point, no bullshit, no nonsense, okay? This, this is what it is. I love you. I'm going to let go of any unhealthy, toxic behavior that I had, but I want this relationship. Five of Wands in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Someone wants, someone's trying to avoid any kind of drama or any kind of conflict that brings drama to their life, okay? The Five of Wands in reverse is someone who's completely avoiding this entire situation, probably because they feel that, again, if they're going to get in with you, again, there's going to be drama, again, there's going to be conflict. There's someone here, I feel, who just doesn't want to compete anymore, okay? Like, you know what? If I have to compete to get you, if I always have to get your attention, or if there's too many people involved here, you know what? I'm done. I don't, I'm not even interested in fighting for this anymore. This is what I get. Alright Capricorn, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please like, share, follow, subscribe, leave your comments below and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.